it's a real mess. It's a, a catastrophic situation. We have a, a lady that have to wait like six or seven hours hanging from a tree in the middle of the floating area that have like eight to 10 feet of water uh, with a life breath and uh, was very, very something that is hard for us to get to her, but because was sweet water is is moving water that we is make the, the job more tough. In addition to that, another person that is a 63 years old man that was hanging in a tree in the same conditions of the lady in a different city, but that guy was uh, eight hours waiting for our our hours to get them. We was able to do the, the right things and save them anyway. We was the only ones that have a, an inflatable boat with the engine that was needed for these floating issues. Even the government doesn't have one. So we have the, the heavy part to do the missions inside the water in three different cities. We have to decide where we have to go first and who can wait and be in the last. Sounds hard, but it's the only way that we can support the different municipalities that have people inside the water uh, in, in life threat. Every year happens, so every year we no experience to be, be more prepared. And thanks to Maria, people were prepared to for fuel, water, food. There, that's why there's no so many fires because people were prepared. They learned from the lessons of the past. A bed or food or material to rebuild the, the houses. Those are the things that everybody who lost their houses will need. Because remember, they lose their houses, but also everything inside. And we know that the government says in a in a public press uh, information that they have everything controlled. It. But the same thing happens when Maria, the Hurricane Maria, hit us. They have they said that they have everything controlled, but that was not the reality. They was not able to reach everybody. I work for the state fire department. So I know the lack of resources that we have in the government emergency services. I know what we need or the support that we need. That's the main thing that make us uh, so strong is because the experience that we have through every year, because we have a pandemic situation emergency we have an earthquake emergency situation. We have the hardest hurricane in history with Hurricane Maria. Honestly, we are a special people that think that everything can be solved, no matter how or when, but we can solve it. Mm -hmm.